Hey everyone and welcome back. Today we're going to be checking out Megan. So a while back I saw the trailer for this movie in theaters and I just thought the concept seemed kind of funny like it could either go good or bad like it mm -hmm. could either be really good or it could be just like really dumb um but we've heard a lot of really good yeah. reviews. Yeah I saw Penguin say that it was moist. <laughs> <laughs> I've yeah. seen other reviews saying that it was like a surprise too and I don't know the the statistics but I'm pretty sure that it was made for like not very much money and mm -hmm. made back a crap ton of money which I haven't seen the trailer but you know from looking at the stills of Megan I kind of feel like I know what's happening I guess it's like she's like a robot I'm guessing and she's gonna be with a child and at that point what's gonna happen it seems mm -hmm. obviously like it's a horror film I've heard some people say that it's a little bit of comedy too so horror I, comedy maybe? well I mean looking at her like I could not freaking stop thinking about like baby Renesme from like Twilight. <laughs> yeah. So we'll see. I'm super excited to check it out though. This seems like a really unique concept. Mm -hmm. Um it's very exciting. I feel like with horror films, like for Casey, they almost kind of be have to be a little comedic, otherwise she oh, won't yeah, watch it. I don't like <laughs> a lot of horror. It's a commercial, like, in yeah. oh my oh. gosh, what the hell? Hey, sweetie, I got someone that's gonna make you feel better. Is it like a Megan? Oh, wait, no, it's a Furby? Oh. <laughs> what is this? It's a Furby. <laughs> Her perpetual bed, oh my god. Oh my god. They can take pictures. Come on, sweetheart. Oh my god. That's kind of scary. Customized app, you can even feed your friends. They have things like this, though. Is shits? Now it. Well, they have little app connected game things. Can watch YouTube videos, learn fun facts, play multi platform game. Honestly, this is like how technology is going to go, though, for kids. I thought we were going to limit screen time to 30 minutes a day. What are you talking about? I didn't get a turn. I'm just saying. I think, Katie, can you turn it down, please? Oh my gosh, I would throw that I out know. the window. It has not stopped talking. Honestly, what is the purpose of a toy if you have to play with it on an iPad? This is what the future looks like. Okay. That's what I said. Have to get used to it. Oh my god! Oh gosh. Oh. oh. All right. I thought that was gonna be worse. Yeah, neither of us knew that was a thing until like 10 minutes ago, okay? Don't act like it's my fault. Like, then why did you drive? Like, Maybe you should pull over if yeah. you don't know how to... I don't know how to drive in snow. We live in Texas. I would not be out there <laughs> yeah. like that. Texas shut down during yeah, that ice storm we can't handle that. What are you doing? Girl, you better uh, put your seatbelt right right back! Oh my goodness gracious! So stop moving forward. Oh, I feel like someone's gonna die. Oh, I feel like they're gonna hit something. Wait for this to clear and then find some place where we can pull over and just wait for one of those snow trucks to clear the road. I'm scared somebody's gonna hit Oh thing. fuck! Oh my gosh. Oh my Oh and it's like Oh I thought it was buffering. <laughs> yeah. Dang. I mean, I thought someone was gonna die. Yeah, that just seemed so bad. So I'm guessing that wasn't the main girl? Like, I don't think that family lived, right? Or maybe, maybe her parents died? Hmm. <laughs> wow, that, this whole toy company is very interesting. It's like very almost dystopic, but yeah. modern. Modern dystopic. Modern dystopic. <laughs> I don't know, is that a thing? It feels um, like it a thing. It is now. It's like right before we get to dystopic, <laughs> is we get stuff like this. Oh, jeez. Oh, I got skin for oh, it. Oh no. I feel like there's too many movies about how this goes wrong. <laughs> Have we not seen Terminator? Sad. That's spooky in itself. Wait, wait, stop. Why is her face doing that? What is happening? I, I don't know. <laughs> Here we go. Maybe she's just sentient already. Oh, shit. oh it's already. Oh my gosh. In each pet, we installed a listening model that targets conversational patterns among kids. Oh my gosh! Yeah, that's... So, we're gonna spy on your kids. It's fine. It's for the future. It's oh for technology. It's Megan? Model 3 generative android. Test load up the intro simulation. Why can't we just give these kids a dog? She was related. Oh, she's gonna take her in. The parents oh. died, I bet. Because they were on the way to go visit her. At least they were talking about her, the parents. Oh, she's the, um, the aunt. Then. Yeah. There's also an element of this movie that feels like it's gonna go down like the trajectory of like Chucky. Is she in Haunting of Hill House, the girl? Hey, hey, 
Hey, oh, look, a dog. Dear. You don't need a. Never mind. It's not your dog. You so you don't need a Megan on your side of the fence. I just spent eighty bucks on a shock collar. Maybe try cranking it up a notch. Oh my gosh. Oh, those aren't toys, Katie. I mean, t yeah, technically, yeah, they're toys. They're just um, collectibles. So you don't actually play with them. She just lost her parents. I'm trying to think if I have anything. Aren't what you like a toy maker? I got you for your birthday. Friggin' got destroyed in the car crash while my parents died. She's very particular. It's interesting that she would work for a toy company, but I guess she's like in the very technology side of it, mm -hmm. you know? Mom always read me a story before bed. Oh, um... She's like, you can just look at the iPad. We don't read really in this house. I kids' know. books here right now, Katie. I can download one on my phone. See? Yeah. That's fine. I feel like this this movie is going down this trajectory of uh, don't be too dependent on technology. Yeah. Well, a lot of it's like stuff we do now, and it's yeah. like trying to show you like it's relatable to our lives now. But it's like I'm digging it. Yeah, it's like I mean, technology has its purposes, but once you go too far, mm -hmm. it's like where do we draw the line? I know. Like maybe we should just go on a hike. Oh, poor thing. You know, you would think she would be more sad, too. I don't know if that was, like, her yeah. brother or her sister. I think it was her sister. I think. Yeah, she did. I mean, I guess everybody handles grief in a different way, but she just seems, like, kind of... Mm, stoic. Just very... Just how she said the thing about, oh, we listening on kids. Like, just so, like... Mm. Like, she doesn't have, like, a whole lot of emotions, it seems. Yeah. Trying to figure out a way to do this. She's kind of an asshole. I don't really like how she's acting. Mm. Yeah, I know, but Jesus, Jeb, you just lost your sister. And we spent a hundred thousand dollars of company. What the fuck is wrong with this gosh. woman? Oh my gosh! Get this pet's prototype to him soon. He's going what? to sue us. Okay. I don't think you can okay. be worried about work right now. Yeah, Jeb. I don't like her. Right now, Ew. I think you just listen to, to your friend. Oh, okay. the therapist. Oh. Sorry. Oh. Yeah. Well, Please maybe she needs a therapist since you're not being very. Yeah. Open with her. What about these ones up here? Those aren't toys. They aren't Gemma's collectibles. That's okay. You can play with them. We can totally play with them. Do you want to play with them? <laughs> you didn't say that yesterday. I oh, know, but in front of the therapist. <laughs> I mean, you could have easily just gone and bought her some new stuff, you know? This is gonna hurt her. Like, uh. <laughs> I mean, like, Why would you open the box like that as well? Like, what the fuck? She's just frustrated. You didn't have to do that. You could have got her different toys and, like, Taught her the distinction between <laughs> collectibles and not. Honestly, like kids find joy in a lot of things, not just toys. Like you could Gemma, give her some art. Exercise. We might let Katie lead. It's just that this is not what it was designed to do. It does other things. <laughs> but yeah, <laughs> totally. Let's just roll <laughs> looks they're giving like each other. She's a control freak. Yeah. Sorry, can I just ask, how close were you and your sister? Probably not. She's gonna well, lie. But you wanted this, right? To take custody? Yeah, of course. Because the father's parents have said they're willing to take her if you feel Oh. Wait, do they contact it's you? It's no big deal, Gemma. They're just trying to be supportive. You're gonna need to make one or two adjustments in order for this to work. Send her to the grandparents. I know. That way she Maybe you could just to... focus on your career and just, you know. Not have to deal with Megan when she pops up no. eventually. <laughs> but she's gonna be like, here, Megan, so I don't have to take oh care gosh, of you. Oh my gosh, yeah. See so yeah, she's just like on her phone while they're eating. I'm telling you, so many little hints to modern society. Mm -hmm. I really like that though. Listen, Katie, and the iPad um, too right there. I have mm -hmm. this project at work that's kind of overdue. And with all the time that I had to take off last week, I'm not really sure I'm gonna get it done. I feel like when we have kids, we need to lie to them and tell them that they're like, you know, born in the stone age. So oh, like, like they don't have technology. Lie to them. <laughs> like I don't want them to know what an iPad is. <laughs> You can use my iPad if you want. Oh. <laughs> Turning her into an iPad kid. Or mm. play a game or something. What about screen time? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, because her uh, mom did Limitations. It. Turn it off. Oh, I don't care as long as you want. Oh, my gosh. This is opening up Pandora's box with this child. It's funny because I literally just saw like a, a reel today of like a kid literally going between TikTok and like playing like a <laughs> video game. <laughs> That's kind of cool. Give me five. But this is how it starts, though. <laughs> oh, come on. You I mean, she is that. controlling this one, though, mm. so. That's still Ow. how it starts. <laughs> it starts with you asking Siri for the freaking weather, and then, like, it kills you in the night. Here. Okay. 
I feel like she represents people who, you know, are just like innovators and like want to do, mm -hmm. want to make things. But is she gonna learn a lesson? But the problem with toys like Bruce is that they're so expensive and most kids can't afford to have one. If I had a toy like Bruce, I don't think I'd ever need another toy again. Oh, and the there one we go, toy light bulb. To end all toys. That's gonna be the marketing strategy. Yeah, like never need another toy again. So it'll be expensive, but you won't have to yeah, buy any more toys. Yeah, but you won't have to toys. buy more toys, and that's like, <laughs> Bruce is helping. The skin is the weird part to me. <laughs> that is spooky already. <laughs> like, it looks like a real girl. I know. Like, even having this room, though, is weird. I think you're gonna like Megan even more. Bruce requires someone else to operate him, but... Megan works all on her own. See, and that's when it starts to get weird. It's like when you're not in control anymore of it. Here, and when you do that, you're gonna pair with her. Oh that means gosh. she'll recognize you as her primary user. Uh, it's nice to meet you, Katie. Ooh, I like that jacket. Oh, it can Where'd measure you your emotional state and stuff? That's so weird. Okay. Like, as a child, this shit would terrify me. Yeah, you think a lot of kids would like cry and freak I out know. and be like, ah! <laughs> they get scared of like, like Disney World, like the little people walking around as their own favorite characters. As a child, I didn't even want to watch Thriller, like the music video. <laughs> like I ran to my room and hid in the closet when I saw it on TV on the Disney Channel once. When I was a kid, I punched Clifford the Big Red Dog <laughs> in, a, in the nose because I got afraid. Oh, I also remember I asked my parents for Resident Evil toys once and then I told them to take them away from me because I was scared of them. <laughs> There's nothing like. there. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, it's having uh, some difficulties. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait. Or it did it. it. It did it on purpose! Oh my gosh! <laughs> the joy is going Do you up. Like it, Katie? Ooh! What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> This is like how people are talking about that AI art thing, mm -hmm. you know, that thing yeah, that was yeah. like going around. <laughs> now I think they're doing more than just art yeah. now. Why do I have to use a coaster? Coasters help to avoid watermarks, especially on wooden surfaces. Like, don't tell me what to do. How does the water get outside the glass? It's gonna teach her. It's actually caused by the difference in temperature outside oh my gosh. the glass. Which pulls Why do they need school then if you're oh, gonna no. teach us everything? Why do we need parents? <laughs> Studies indicate that a staggering 78% of a parent's time is spent dishing out the same basic instructions. Oh my God, Katie, you have to flush the toilet. But like, what about parental love? Like, are you not factoring in that? Well, she's not a parent. Yeah. Mm. She was thrust into it. Wash your hands. <laughs> Roll up your sleeves. Like, stop nagging me. Megan's an excellent listener. My big question now is, is Megan gonna turn on Katie? Or is like she gonna think protecting Katie is so important yeah. that she does crazy shit for Katie? And she'll never run out of patience. Katie, seriously, flush the toilet. <laughs> I mean, that was a little sassy. But it's weird that your toy would become your authority. I know. And your friend, like everything, is charging. That is <laughs> terrifying. I'm sorry. Take care of the little things, so you can spend more time doing the things that matter. Oh, that's weird. Like watching TV. Well, why would you want Megan to do all that stuff? They're emergent capabilities. Mm, exactly. Voice of reason. Well, does any of that bother you? Megan's gonna kill her first. I mean, if you're having Megan talk Katie in and read her a bedtime story. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. What about the parent? Or even talking with her. I don't mm -hmm. really think this is any of your business. If you're spending less time with your child as a result of Megan, that is something we should be aware of. She's not my child. What? She's your adopted child. Yeah. Oh my gosh, this woman? Frankenstein's monster needs to take out Frankenstein. Yeah, Megan, turn off. Katie James, daughter of Nicole and Ryan James, killed in a collision on Interstate 84 outside of Oregon. Yeah. Shit, she's still paired with Katie. You didn't code in parental controls? I didn't have time to implement them before um, my life. Because you didn't think like that because you're not, I mean, not that we're parents, <laughs> but you didn't think like a parent, <laughs> like, okay, how could this go wrong? Death. Yes, I know. We're looking into it. Gathering auxiliary internet data on death. I meant at a later point. Oh Calculated my gosh. Factor representation. Death is the end of life. Oh, oh my gosh. So now you, they're going to go teach about death. I know. She's like, perfect. I'm going to go killing. Will I die? 
Ooh. Actually, let's uh, just avoid this topic altogether. Hopefully. Your goal <laughs> is to protect Katie from harm, both physical and emotional. Why don't you become like freaking Ultron? <laughs> Megan. Yes, Jenna. You are that was sassy. second primary user. I just, it's so insane to me that she didn't think like of anything that could be negative about this. I mean, we've seen how little yeah. emotion she's had, even when her sister died. Like, I'm honestly surprised that she didn't just be like, yeah, of course uh, she can go to like the father's parents. Yeah. Like, she's playing outside. Let her play outside. That's what she should do. Pretend to play is super important mm. for kids. Gotcha. You're dead. <laughs> oh. Oh, she might not like that. I'm dead. I lost one of my arrows. Megan, can you see it? What are you? She's like like scanning. a weapon. Like it's like a weapon. I don't know. She's just learning. Like mm -hmm. taking in everything. Oh, don't kill the dog. Oh my. Don't gosh. kill the dog. She's gonna see it as a. Oh, she's gonna go get. Please don't kill the dog. Then the dog might come over here. Why did the n neighbor not freaking patch up her fence? Ooh, oh, yeah. she's gonna kill the dog. No, the the aunt is gonna come out and get pissed. Oh, noise canceling headphones. I just bought Anthony some of those. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh shit, no. she's gonna protect her. Oh no. Uh, the dog's dead, I bet. Yeah. Oh my god. Wait, not yet. How many times do I have to uh, tell you to keep your dog off my property? He wasn't on your property. That's true, he wasn't. Swear to God, if you don't put your dog down, I'm gonna do it for you. <gasps> what the fuck? Jenna, Kitty's temperature is rising. Her wound needs to be disinfected immediately. This wouldn't have happened if you'd fixed the fence. Oh, it was her responsibility to fix the fence. <laughs> look at that look that she gave her. <gasps> oh my that's gosh. a sticky situation because yeah. it's like you could have like I still know. hold up like it, the holes on your side too like yeah the incident happened probably because of her but like also they did come to your property and the dog was defending the but property at this point I feel like Megan's gonna kill the dog and the woman she's like gonna take matters into her own hands look Dog doesn't have a history of violence. State law says he can't forcibly be put down. I can't believe you would call to forcibly put down the dog. I mean, I guess because it bit her, but like, mm. like I said, they were on the property too, though. Why don't you just put the hole and oh fix my it? Gosh, she's gonna kill the dog. Oh, oh my she's gosh. Dying. I just, I'm so annoyed that there's still a freaking hole in the fence. Like somebody. Joey. Come here, boy. She's mimicking the voice. Oh, oh my gosh! She's probably gonna choke it out. I don't. Does she have strength like that? Or strangle it? Maybe there's like she didn't a freaking weapon on her. Thing I mean, maybe to she like does, choke actually. it. I don't want to see a dog die. Oh, she, oh my gosh! Oh, she does have like strength like that. What did she do with the body? Oh my gosh! That freaking dog suffered because both of these people. We're too stubborn to fix the dang fence. Somebody should have done it. It didn't matter who. And if you loved your dog, you would have fixed the fence. Or at least, honestly, just put a board in front of the That's fence. That's what I'm saying. Like, just p block it. Like, there was no other solution just to leave it open? So she killed her first animal. When is she going to kill her first human? Do you think that you'll be up for it? You don't have to do it if you don't want to do it. I mean, there are people who flew across oh the country. Oh my gosh, that's like, ah, uh, I hate when. If you're not up to it, I'd just rather you tell me now, okay? I'll be all right. She literally just got bit by a dog. Mm -hmm. Like, said she doesn't have any like maternal mm -hmm. instincts or warmth or anything for her. Like, even your niece, you would she think you'd like, have no something. Emotion. She didn't even give a fuck that her sister died. She was worried about getting sued. Have genuine, spontaneous response that had a mind all of its own, that looked and behaved exactly like a real child. How were like people's like first impressions of this not like F no? Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, she's the apex of 21st century technology wrapped up in four feet. I don't really silicone. understand that because like, th there's different toys for different reasons. Like what if you want to make, like build something with like a Play-Doh, you know, like she can't replace Play-Doh unless she, I don't know, mm -hmm. can be like, <laughs> I don't know. Hi, Megan. You know, like, different toys do different things. Like, you don't always want a child to talk to. Oh. Aww. 
<laughs> she gonna cheer her up? Probably, and they're gonna freaking eat it up. Every day I wake up in this strange house, and I remember Aww. that my parents are dead. And she's just worried about how it's gonna yeah. affect her meeting. She's gonna like make her feel better. Megan is gonna kill her, like the aunt. Why is Megan being a better mom than her aunt is? <laughs> Tell me something about your mom. Something oh. that makes you happy. Megan has more empathy. Oh shit. One time she found a cockroach in my school bag. She was upset because I didn't eat my sandwiches. The heck? And then all of a sudden, <laughs> this thing crawls up her wrist and she just started screaming like a maniac and ran out of the house. That's a weird memory to talk about. It's pretty funny. What the heck? That was the only thing you could think of? Gosh, the, the executives are gonna be like, yes! And I'll keep it safe. And we can listen to it whenever we want. If you should. Oh my god! god. <laughs> I kinda like Megan. <laughs> oh my god, she's terrifying though. I know she's scary, but she's kinda chill. But honestly, I don't. I dislike the aunt even more oh, so yeah. than Megan. I'm so glad. Aww. <laughs> This Why scene, am I like, oh! <laughs> this seems like a freaking, uh, like a princess in a Disney movie singing her song. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, they're just like, they're only seeing the money, like, yeah. through their eyes. There's a, this movie also talks a lot about, like, adults and how they act, you know, not like all adults, but like, you know, metaphorically, kind of just ignoring child's needs and stuff for money. Hey, I'm sorry about today. I shouldn't have put you in that position if you weren't feeling up to it. I worked out. Three, two, one, I win! Hey! <laughs> well, anyway, I just wanted to say that. Hey, hey! Megan, I feel like she's kind of trying, like... Yeah. Well, I think... Yeah. If she tries, like, I'll because feel better about her, you know? You, Katie. Megan, like, turn off. I understand not being, just you know, being thrust day. into it and, like, messing up at if first. If by the end of this movie she puts a bullet in Megan's <laughs> brain, I will have, like, warmed up to her. But if you ever need to talk about any of that stuff, See? well, that was nice. Yeah. But oh, but she's she's gone too far. You gave her too much friggin' screen time. <laughs> Dad, I don't want to talk about it. I want to turn Megan back on. Megan, turn on. Oh. Uh, she's turned into a bratty child. She had structure with her parents. I know. She was you drawing ruined her. pictures. And it all started with her telling her that she didn't have a time limit on the iPad. <laughs> Now she's no gonna hate therapy. Any thoughts you have are okay. What is Megan gonna think about I therapy? Know. I don't know if she's Megan's like, I'm your therapist. <laughs> I was gonna say, I don't know if she's Googled it yet. No <laughs> freaking tissue. Oh! <laughs> you made her cry. Oh, uh, no. you don't understand that. You don't have humanism, so you don't understand. Humanism? This makes me want to watch the movie Her <laughs> with what's his face? <laughs> Joaquin Phoenix? <laughs> that was a good movie. But Megan's actually been pretty instrumental in helping Katie get over the loss. Mm. It's honestly like she's part of the family now. She I mean, got brainwashed. She didn't look too excited about it. Do you know anything about attachment theory? When a child loses a parent, they look to form attachments with the next person that comes into their life. The person that's going to provide love and And you were and shitty about it, so. so now it's Megan. Model, which in an ordinary situation would be you, right? <laughs> but you've created a toy that's so real, it's possible that Katie might not see her as a toy, but as a Person. primary caregiver. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Megan's gonna kill the therapist. If you make a toy that's impossible to let go of, then how do you ever expect a child to grow? Yeah, that's true. Like, are you just gonna take it into adulthood? You could be building emotional connections with this doll that are too hard to untangle. Finally a go. voice of reason from there an adult in this movie. And then Megan is gonna take her out. You have to eat the toppings, Katie, not just the bread. It's like three pieces of tiny leaf, who cares? Mm -hmm, I know. I'm learning faster with Megan than I ever have before. We're already on fourth grade math. But it's about more than just grades, Katie. It's about developing social, social skills. Interaction. And that yeah. is something that you can only get from spending time around other kids, real kids. Yeah, that's true. Oh, I found this place. <laughs> kind of an alternative school. You get to learn outdoors. And it's just for kids well, who are exactly fun. like you. Kids who think outside the box. Can I bring Megan? Katie, you Please know don't bring Megan. I know. Because if a kid picks on you, then like you she's gonna like kill that child. I don't want to do. Actually, oh I can. That's basically what a guardian does. Hey, I'm sorry. Let's just talk about it. Hey, hey, hey. Let me go. Whoa. Oh, okay. Megan. What's going on? Stop it. Look. Let her go. She, oh. What Ooh. the fuck? How did she do that? <laughs> Created a monster. Megan, turn off. Are you sure? Oh. <laughs> 
This is just like when Tony Stark made Ultron. Yeah. I'm not going. Not without Megan. Okay, A, that is never gonna happen. And B, the launch is in less than a week. I have to take her to work with this. I thought you said she was mine alone. Hey! Oh my gosh. Do we have some new adventurers with she us? She got spoiled. I know, you turned her into a brat. Is this your sister? She was a respectable child. Oh, Jesus Christ. Well, uh, well, we do have a toy table where the kids leave No, don't, like no, don't offer that. Mm -hmm. That is up to you. She's actually a working prototype, so I shouldn't even have her out in public. Well, if you did want to stay and keep an eye on her, we could use some help making sandwiches. <laughs> oh my gosh. You've equipped me with advanced dual frequency GPS. We hold your so ground! Put your foot down. I know. Okay, but she stays at the toy table, and as far as anyone is concerned... She's very irresponsible as a scientist. Like, yeah. you have this prototype that you don't even know what she could do yet. She's already, like, talking back to you. I know. And you're gonna bring her out around other kids? <laughs> she's just there with all the other freaking stuffed oh. animals? So great to get them out in the fresh air and off those devices. Oh! As she's on her phone. My son prefers it to regular school. Which one is yours? The one in the flannel shirt? He's actually quite a sensitive little soul. Brandon, honey! Are you warm enough? Do you need your hat? Fuck off, Holly. No! <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, Jotaro. <laughs> it's like the two extremes of parenting, yeah. like when you don't have enough like a structure <laughs> and then you have like too much or not a, I don't know. You know what I mean? Yeah. Whatever is going on there. <laughs> Brandon, why don't you go with Katie? Hey, Felix, you can go with all Oh my god. Honestly, gosh. you look too old to be in this class. What are you doing? Brandon here? is going to treat her like shit, and yeah. Megan we'll do might Brandon. kill him. What do you have kill as your first thing? Well, I like, she already kill killed the, the damn dog. I don't know what she did with the damn body. Did she watch Breaking Bad to see how to dispose of one or what? She downloaded it. Because <laughs> she told her, protect Katie. That's like your primary goal. Yeah. So, of course, she's going to do everything and anything. Freaking Brandon. You can have it. You need some discipline too. Ow, stop, stop. Oh, my oh my god, stop. you're a psycho yeah. little kid. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Make her say something. Oh my gosh. Make her say something. Oh, uh, 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 excuse you. Okay. Oh, stop wrong it. idea. And they say behavioral issues are linked to high IQ, so it would make sense. Well, that's, 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 you know, <laughs> you're yeah, not the parent you know, to be speaking right yeah. now. Yeah, I don't know if you know what you're talking about, little like, lady. <laughs> the aunt is a shitty parent as well, but like, I don't really freaking have you higher than her at this point. Hi, Megan. Oh, so you're not gonna play with me? What are you even trying to do? You don't want to play, huh? Yeah. Oh, I thought that was gonna go over I know, direction really for a second. Weird, I was like, yeah. whoa. It's a stupid rubber doll with fake hair. <gasps> Ow! Let go! You need uh, to well, learn some you know. manners, Brandon. <laughs> <laughs> you know what happens to bad boys that don't mind their manners? They grow up to be bad men. Are you listening to me, Brandon? <gasps> oh my gosh! <laughs> oh! Oh. She ripped it off, or at least part of it. Whoa, shit! This is the part where you run. Oh, well, she didn't kill him. That's positive, unless she wants to chase. Oh my gosh, if she starts running. Oh, oh my gosh! <laughs> She's like freaking involved to hunting for sport! What the fuck? <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> what the hell? She went goblin mode. Oh my gosh. Oh, 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 oh my gosh, oh my gosh. And then she got the perfect oh excuse. My oh gosh. my gosh. Brandon was a little freaking brat, but that was too much. Mm. Oh no. Oh, that, that makes me so, so sad. Wild. Yeah. And he was only probably like that because his freaking mom. Yeah. Oh my gosh. That was like crazy. It's weird though, cause she didn't like, I mean she was chasing him, but she didn't like directly push him into the road, like he tripped. Mm. Not that I'm like excusing it, but like, you know, it's not like she was like... Yeah, well, let's see where she goes. I still feel like by the end of this friggin' film, she's gonna kill somebody. Do you think what Aunt Gemma said is true? That he's in a better place now? <laughs> no, <laughs> he's nowhere. If heaven exists, it wouldn't be for boys like Brandon now. Oh my gosh! Bulletproof, oh my God. <laughs> this song makes me think of Pitch Perfect. Yeah. 
Ricochet, you take your I actually really like the song to be honest. Away. Titanium, right? Uh, yeah. Shoot me down. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I am Titan. <laughs> What's going on? Where's Shuey? He's 34 feet southwest and approximately 5 feet deep. What are you? I've been asking myself that same question. Oh my god. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, the poison? The pesticide! Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh, oh my, my gosh. gosh! Oh, wow. I mean, I was waiting for it. Like, I knew she yeah. was gonna freaking kill somebody at some point. Now, people are gonna be, like, blaming Gemma. I don't know anything about the dog, okay? Can you just I mean, it is her stuff? fault! That might be difficult. You made this! Is she gonna have any emotion to this? Me I mean, she didn't even care about her sister dying. Here. All night. But when is she gonna start thinking about friggin' mm -hmm. Megan as the suspect? Do you see this pen? Stop her freaking head with it. Okay. Oh, she tricked her. Yeah. At I bet she already. Button. She disabled it already, I bet. At least Let's see. thought to do that. Oh my gosh, I would have like. Burn, burn this it. damn thing in like, the backyard. You know what? I quit. What's wrong with you? Look, I know oh you're very gosh. attached. She doesn't to understand because she's a kid. Friend. Just send her to her freaking grandparents and like get rid of this damn toy. Burn it. You can look at all of the cool toys. We don't have any cool toys. Professional <laughs> pets suck. They <laughs> suck shit. Hey, <gasps> oh, oh, hey, don't hey, get in a car. Oh, oh my gosh, we don't need that again. Honestly, as if she was being deliberately vague. Okay, well, that's what spontaneous <laughs> response is. It's a curated word salad plucked from a sea of data. You were the voice of reason earlier. Know, what the what hell is going on? If keeping Katie safe meant eliminating a potential threat, theoretically... No, no, no. Gemma, come on. This is impossible. Look at her. She's a toy. <laughs> She's four feet tall. She's like in bubble wrap. Nothing's backed up for two days. We're about to launch this to the world in less than four hours. Exactly. Well, terrible idea. Well, if Megan's responsible... You have not had it nearly this. enough time in development. <laughs> Stupid. Check the inputs on the learning model. Even if she deleted specific files, she would never undo what she's learned. Oh, oh my gosh. gosh! She's the toy every kid wants and every parent oh, needs. Oh shit, they already made the announcement. That's what Funky Toy says about they need Nanny 911. <laughs> Nanny Joe. But what is a Megan? What does she actually do? People like cosplaying as <laughs> her? I want to cosplay as her. Oh I was already gosh. planning it out in my head. I'm the only thing that matters to her. Kind of the way mom used to. And that's all I was gonna say. Exactly how a parent should be looking at their child. She's driving. Now imagine what a toy like Megan could do for hundreds of thousands of kids all across the world. Even the ones who don't have dead parents. What? <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, Katie, look, I know well, that you're upset, but there are ways that we can work through this. Oh my god, okay. Oh, oh my god. Right you're oh, making a little oh, serial killer. Oh! I did that to my mom once and she's well maybe I shouldn't say it. <laughs> she hit me right back. <laughs> and I never hit her again. Hey. When Megan's around, I don't feel like this. But you should oh my feel gosh, like this. She sounds like a drug addict. <laughs> yeah. Katie, you lost your parents. Well, and you didn't let her grieve mm. properly. I can't promise you that these feelings you're feeling are ever gonna go away. But I can promise you that you'll get through it. We both will. It didn't even freaking phase you. She's like, don't worry, I'll make a hologram and you can talk to them. It's fine. You know I made a promise to your mom that if anything happens, I would be there for you. You are all that matters to me now. Right. Hopefully now. Just hopefully but, now that you're, you know. Uh, you, that's not how you started. But I'm all for character development. Learn a lesson. At this point, just wait for her to get a vibranium body. Well, oh, he's dead. <gasps> yeah. Oh, not yet. Oh, no, he's dead. Oh, shit! Right in front of Throw you! Throw a chair at her! Oh. Do something! Why did you pick the smallest I freaking know. weapon? That tiny-ass little saw? For his, Oh. Take out the, the issue! Uh, I guess you gotta save him before he chokes, but I would've killed the thing. <gasps> Run, uh, run, 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 both of you, run, 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 run. Oh dead. my they're gosh. Both die. We don't have time for you to be dazed. I know you just got choked out, but we gotta go. No. Wait. Oh, wait. Oh, well, okay, they're, they're okay, good. Okay. I thought it was gonna be a lot worse. Uh. 
It looks like The Shining, but with one girl. It's funny because I've never actually. What the? <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> what are you doing? What is happening? Oh my gosh! Why did she dance? I uh, distraction, I guess. I was gonna say I've never actually seen The Shining. Me neither. But like I know that scene with the two little yeah. girls. Uh, oh my god! Oh shit! And then. Is, I don't like see. I just I am the quitting does she want to kill him today. Let's see. Did she just press the button or did she take him out too? Maybe she only wanted to defeat certain people. <laughs> defeat. <laughs> I didn't kill anyone, Kurt. You did. It's understandable, really. Your boss despised you. Oh, she already's been like observing. <gasps> oh my shit! I love this movie. <laughs> When Mac oh my kills, gosh! Really important that we get big reactions. We're gonna do a little As this elevator's like on murdered. Three. One. Okay, this. She's gonna steal a car? Oh my gosh! Humanity kills every day just to make its own existence more tolerable. <laughs> this is what so AI always goes to, to like wars sure. and whatnot, and justifies its killing. The point I'm trying to don't let her get I close get to you. It. Oh, don't let her touch you. Being a gonna parent choke is you. never in the cards for you. Your first love is always going to be your career, and you shouldn't have to feel guilty about that. <laughs> Let me focus on Katie so that you can focus on the things that matter most to you. Megan, do you see this pen? <laughs> like, yeah, she already learned. Yeah. We're exhausting. Katie, don't come in here. Oh, this bitch. I thought I heard something. If she comes in this room, I'll rip your head right off your neck, <gasps> I swear to God. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Oh. It sounds like you're fighting. We're not fighting. Oh my gosh. Kill her with a coaster. Oh wait. Oh, the water. The water? It shorted her out? Oh my gosh. If like you're Drown able her. to like get her freaking hands off of you, then you need to rip her head off of her body. Oh, oh. my gosh. You need Throw to freaking water. move. Find a weapon. Get Katie and leave. And decapitate this thing. Get Bruce to fight back. I know. Bruce! Bruce! Oh, we Grab the gloves! Just, Grab the gloves and fight her ass down. with it! That was not a thing. Oh my gosh. Be smarter. Oh my oh, gosh! You just gave her a weapon! You're in the friggin' like you have so many weapons here! Grab whatever that fucking thing is, yeah, kill her! She can't even get it out the wall! Oh my gosh, you might deserve to die. No. <laughs> I mean in this in the movie. <laughs> Oh, Ooh, shit. okay, all right, all right, all right. Come on, end it. Honestly, anybody out there trying to make an AI thingy, make a fail safe. Mm -hmm. Something that, oh, well, like, you can turn it she off. She thought she had a fail safe, and that didn't work. Keep attacking! Oh my god, this is crazy! Oh my gosh. At this point, Katie needs to grab the hands for a freaking what's his face. But I have another emerging capability you probably haven't figured out yet. What? And that's palliative care. You see this pen? <gasps> oh shit. A short, sharp probe to the cerebral cortex would cause full body paralysis and could even cause the victim to bite off their own tongue. Perhaps then you might appreciate just how useful I can be. <gasps> okay. Tell me you have the gloves. Oh, Katie, I didn't want you to have She to has to have this. the gloves. No, She's hiding her hands. You know that what I said is true. She's not fit to be a mother. Look at her. she got the gloves. Just go get out of here now. Come on, Bruce. This is the best thing for all of us. This is how we stay a family. There's another member from the family we didn't tell you about. Bruce. Bruce! His name is Bruce. Mm -hmm. Crush like, her like, head. Like something got a marvel. <laughs> <laughs> like we have a Hulk. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> no, Bruce! Oh my gosh. For humanity! <laughs> this is just like when uh, John Connor reprogrammed the Terminator. Got to no, no don't let her see. Do like the Loki treatment on this bitch. Oh yes. Oh, oh shit! <laughs> she might crawl. Uh, she's gonna be like freaking Darth Maul. <laughs> she's not dead. She's not dead. I told you. Fucking use Bruce. Maybe Gemma's I mean, actually gonna be a mom. 
Oh, good. Look. Oh, damn it. He tripped. No. Oh, shit. You killed Bruce. He was our only ally in this world against the AI. <laughs> You're a oh, grateful my God. little bitch. Me too. Oh, oh, Megan. 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 Okay. Ah. I have a new primary user now. Me. Crusher. There we go. Gouge out her eyes. Do anything you can. Take, Take her, her out with her battery. Oh. Oh my gosh. Oh, we're gonna need you, Katie. I know you're Do like something. a kid, but. Oh, screwdriver. Katie's taking care of business more so uh, no. than she is. Like honestly, like Gemma would have died. Like if it wasn't for I her. I know. She's the one. Yeah. Who came in with Bruce? She's the one who put a screwdriver in your in freaking Megan's head. <laughs> and now we learned our lesson. Don't make these things. Yeah. Is she not dead? Did she transfer her oh! shit to this damn Alexa thing? She's Elsa or whatever. Uh, Elsa. <laughs> like, let yeah, it's so her. Let it go. It yes. went full Ultron. Oh man. As long as there's access to the internet. Oh my god. They better make a sequel. They have that to. Was so it was so successful. Good. So I really love this movie. It was so fun. I think this has been one of the most fun reactions <laughs> I felt that we've had on the channel. This is such yeah. a fun movie to watch. It was super good too. Uh, exceeded my expectations. Yeah, I would say in terms of fun, how much I had like watching a movie, I feel like it's up there. Um, you know, you want to throw like a horror spin onto it. I will say like the the Netflix adaptation of uh, Death Note. I had a lot of fun with that. Not because it was a good movie <laughs> though. I was just clowning on it throughout. But yeah, I I actually really like the uh, the theme about this too. Yeah. You know, being dependent on technology, uh, kind of like allowing your kid to just play with right. something like as opposed to kid. in that situation, she just gave her like technology and was like, hey, here, be the parent I'm supposed to be. Yeah. Um, and obviously. Obviously, with Gemma, right. she didn't really yeah. know how to be a parent, and she got there eventually. But um, I just really like the concept of this movie. I will say, like, you know, there are some parts that were cheesy, some parts that were kind of scary, but kind of indirectly scary, only just honestly because Megan was so creepy. But I actually just found myself, like, having a fun time just yeah. watching it. Like, I thought it was very humorous. I feel like the cheesy moments were done on purpose, and it worked super well. Like, when she started dancing? Yeah, that <laughs> was so funny. It was really good. I really like the message, too. I mean, technology can be really good. Obviously, we use technology. Mm -hmm. Everybody uses technology. There's been so many uses for it, and it's really helped humanity a lot as well. But on the other hand, it could go too far. Yeah. And I feel like this movie did a great job of showing kind of the direction we're going in. There yeah. was a lot of things in this that didn't, like it didn't feel like a typical sci-fi, like, oh, that's so far in the future, it's so far away, it's we're not. never gonna see that. Yeah. A lot of this stuff looked like it could be things that you saw to this day, you know, like especially with that little furry thing, furry. <laughs> <laughs> furry thing. The little toy, like yeah. that looks like something I saw an advertisement for. So it was just, it was really interesting and then I also liked how it showed not only like Gemma's style of parenting, um, like like the just super technology kind of hands off, but it showed the opposite end, like hands off in the sense of of like that kid Brandon, I think too. Yeah. Like it showed both sides, and I thought that was really cool, just kind of perspective as well. Like it wasn't just one side; it showed different aspects of parenting too. And I feel like the root of it was like, you know, parents, you can't really replace love yeah. as a parent. Like you discipline your kids and you kind of teach them right for wrong out of love, not just because, oh, like I think there was one part that was like, oh, parents spend most of their time repeating the same things. It's like you do it because you want them to do better and have yeah. a good life and not Whereas, get hurt. Whereas like Megan was doing that and right. she just went straight to the television and on her yeah. computer. So I feel like you could really go in and dissect it um, and all the little valuable, life lessons in there too. Like I said at the beginning, when I saw this trailer, I thought it was gonna be just like kind of a class B, kind of cheesy horror film. Kind of like those ones that are, I don't know if y'all know what I'm talking about, the ones where they're like the text and then they kill people, like they, yeah, weird social media stuff, you know? There was one that they made a few years yes, ago, that's, Unfriended. That's it was I'm Unfriended, about, I never watched it. We never it. saw yeah. it, so I don't actually know if it was good or not, but the trailer, the concept it reminded silly. me of that. And I was like, okay, is this gonna be another one of those? But it was very good. 
it's funny because the concept seems like ridiculous on a surface level, but then when you look at like all the intricacies, like you said, with like uh, with Gemma being like a new mom, but she was kind of emotionless, caught up in her work, more worried about her work, honestly, yeah. than her own sister's death. And then kind of seeing like where like, you know, their relationship kind of started off with her niece when she moved into the house, like, oh, here, take the iPad type of thing. But in this instance, it was like a freaking AI. I am glad that Gemma kind of like saw the error of her ways because at the beginning I was kind of thinking it could go either way you know she's either going to find out that I made a grave mistake or she was going to become Frankenstein. I think another theme in this movie was a lot of the adults just were not really paying attention or caring about a lot of the things around them like with the freaking dog in the fence I could not get over that like they were both just not wanting to fix the hole in the fence which would have solved the problem they can they seemed a little bit more focused on bitching at each other yes. than actually alleviating the, the issue the kids and the dog suffered and it, like it was just crazy and and especially with the executives too they only wanted the money Bottom and just line, stuff yeah. like that like nobody really paid attention to the kids who were the actual consumers of the product who ultimately were the ones who were going to be affected by it. It was all about money. So yeah, I think it was a really good message and I thought it was great. <laughs> yeah, you know, going back to what you said a little earlier, it is kind of scary to think about how close we are to yeah. that. I mean, Elon Musk over here making Neuralink and whatnot. <laughs> I don't know where that's going to take us. Think about it from, I mean, I grew up in the early 90s. So at that point, you know, I had video games and whatnot, but I really wasn't introduced to like, you know, modern technology until like the first iPhone came out in 2007. So I was like 16 when that came out where you actually you know had the internet in your pocket um, so it's interesting to see like, where this generation of children could end up one day yeah uh, like I think I was one of the last generations that actually played outside like you know your mom would be like go play outside and 96 yeah I feel like I was at the tail end of that because I didn't really grow up with technology as it is now and then it kind of like Instagram came around when I was a like freshman a in high school. Yeah. Now this generation has grown up on technology, like just with phones and stuff like iPhones and all that stuff. So it, it is pretty interesting, yeah. like seeing the differences and it'll be interesting to see where it goes. It's also really interesting to see like when you look at a, like a child, even like an infant, they see you on your phone. Mm -hmm. So they gravitate towards the phone. Yeah. So like I see like two year olds and toddlers grabbing at technology because they're so like mesmerized by like, why is my parent always looking mm -hmm. at this type of thing? It's really interesting. I'm going to yeah. have a stew on it for a little yeah, bit. Yeah, this movie makes you think, and I think that's one of the great things about it. All right, well, thank you so much for watching this reaction, and we will see you next time. Bye, everyone.